He used to tell me about the Jayhawkers raid. And I heard the Jayhawkers story so much coming up. I decided to research and see who the Jayhawkers was when I did become an adult. To find out the Jayhawkers was people coming from the Carolinas and Virginia. Okay? Who were coming in to destroy us down here and run us out. Along with the Jayhawkers were black Jayhawkers. Not just white. Because I asked my grandfather, and he said, no, they was all colors. Come to find out who people call Buffalo Soldiers is who my grandfather called a black Jayhawker. Okay? Now, mm. they would come in and gut the babies out of the Indian women belly. They would mm. scalp people and take the scalps back to Fort Pike, which is maybe about 10 to 12 miles from where I'm sitting right now. Mm. And if they bring back the scalp with it and wipe out the women, they'd get more money for the women had than they did the men's for some reason. And if they brought back baby scalps, if they only brought a few scalps back, they could get a furlough. This is what people don't understand about Buffalo soldiers. They weren't even free. They were still slaves fighting for their masters. And uh, for that 40 acres and a mule that they was promising to them. Okay? So... They would go back and get furloughs or passes, as people want to call them. Or if they wipe out a whole village, they could get their freedom papers. Okay? Now, some of these same people who raided our communities were people when their masters was chasing them from St. John and St. Jane Parish. They would cross over to our side. Our people brought them into places to hide them. And they were the ones who could lead them back to secret hiding places to wipe the people out. Yes, that happened. And it's documented. Because the priests began to write it down and send it back to France, what was happening to our people in this village. I'm not a, a, a fan of Buffalo Soldiers. Okay? Because Buffalo Soldiers was used to kill my people. We got to stop being racist against people by the color of their skin because if that's the thing. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We're serious. We're blaming white folks for everything. But we don't want to say what then happened with black folks and did to black people, okay? Yeah, yeah. And that's that's about black on black crime. Black on black crime been going on because that was black people came to this country killing black Indians. And we need to be honest. That's okay? right. That's right. That's right. We need to be honest. I, I, like this here. The white man could not have done got into a black village to do the damage he did like a black European to get into our village and do damage. Okay? I had aunties who married black men that was not native. And they ended up selling my aunties land to the white man. Okay? And another thing people need to realize, my family were voting in the 1700s and the 1800s because we owned land. Some of these stories, everybody trying to make this one slave story to everybody been a slave. I don't have a slave story for being out of no slavery. My people owned ships. They made bricks. They shipped goods around the country. We have uh, uh, dockets with what they were doing. We are getting ready to raise a flag here in St. Tammany Parish that's going to say 500 and plus B.C. That even the white folks here know the records go back. Now, how many people out there tell me where they come from and what they are? What state is raising your flag? Mm. What state? Now, now, that's so deep. Let, 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 let me stop because, see, you said, what's the name of your parish? Timony? St. Tammany. St. Tammany. Which is named yep. after Tammany Hall. Look, which is named after Tammany Hall. Hall. Tammany Hall in New York, y'all. Tammany Hall is where they created the political party system in that. Look it up. Tammany Hall. Y'all better she look it up. Tammany Hall after a Native American, too. That's right. Okay? That's right. Oh, I'm aware of it. Tammany. Tammany. That's right. Tammany Hall. Look up New Yorkers. All you in b New York, Bronx. Y'all look all that up. Because you'll find out that's where all the clandestine agreements was made. That was, the, the, that was the, 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 the money maker of America. That was the that's Wall right. Street of white man's money movement. That's right. 
We're giving it to you right here. Look it up, all you who say you love it. Now, let's look, cause we got a lot of program to go. Now, I'm going to ask you some questions because I know I'm going to give everybody some time later. We will get a chance to talk to the chief. Um, there, there's a lot of things that has um, taken place. Uh, you have, been, I, I have to give you accolades. Accolades, dude, you've been recognized. Uh, I'm not a fan of Bill Clinton, but Bill Clinton, uh, all, the United States has actually recognized and have had you on many uh of these panels um let me just ask you because you mentioned casinos i'm one who think if casinos can generate a new upper class quickly do you think that maybe some of the uh, black indigenous people should maybe should maybe try to go that direction from what, what direction seen, is from what i've seen with casinos is a myth out there people think what's going on with casinos on reservations is what's happening but it's not okay okay Okay. That's a myth, all right? If that was a way to elevate my people, and that was a part of the trees that we had, I would fight for that, okay? But I see the casinos is like this. Most people like Donald Trump is the investors on your reservation for a casino making money on your reservation. So you got oh. the same 1% making money off them reservations, okay? Oh, my God. Did you just say who I thought the one they going to, they wanted, the one they all screaming for? Go ahead, keep going, keep going, keep going. So the casinos is not what people think. The casinos is just like the, the federally recognized tribe. White folks got 556 sovereign nation, and black folks ain't got nothing because we can't get along. Mm-hmm. Bottom line. White I, folks I like. on reservations going to have their guns, and white folks going to be going around throughout the rest of the United States taking black folks' guns. But they won't be able to take them off a reservation because that's 556 federally recognized tribes. So hold on, let Come me on. get this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get this because this sounds pretty scary here. So maybe they got a scheme going on to get white folks. No, take the word maybe out. Take the word maybe out. Okay, okay. Let me take, take that word. They got a scheme going on, telling white folks to join, n- become Native Americans, so they can't get their guns taken. That's a now right there. It's very. That is so. It's not so, just the guns. They're gonna be able to have money. They get the set aside. They get the minority set aside. They get the Indian set aside. Oh, my goodness. The white folks been on welfare since they come to this country. Mm. That's the real welfare. Wow, Chief, I'm going to tell you right there now. Me me and you talking, and and right there, I I, I already know you're telling facts because you can see it. The reason why the tribes, and and notice they were, you correct me if I'm wrong, during the time when this was going on they were actually trying to get the uh other tribes to say no go against the black tribes i remember it was a time when, the, when they, that's when they were going against the black indigenous farmers that's right and not soon the black indigenous farmer won their fight did not them white indians win off that same fight ain't that the fight yeah. nothing they ain't fight fight nothing they won Right. So, um, while we're sitting here arguing over if we Hebrew, Moors, indigenous or not, some people get their act together. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's what we talk okay. tonight. Mm-hmm. We that's can't what... get our act together because we stuck on the word stupid. <laughs> and they know we stuck on stupid. Okay, you, ever, you know on a 45 record it gets...